This training and awareness video on fall protection has been created for you by the Alberta Construction Safety Association in conjunction with Fall Protection Group. Its purpose is to introduce the basic concepts of fall protection, the standards governing it, the equipment used, how to develop and implement a fall protection plan, and we'll have a work scenario to check your understanding of this information. Millions of workers have been put at risk over the years while working at height because they lack the training and or the equipment to perform the job safely. 3,400 workers built the Empire State Building in New York in just over one year. At the time, the 102-story building was the tallest in the world. You may call these men brave or heroic, but five died on that project. That's a rate of one death every 12 weeks. As you can see, there is no evidence of any form of fall protection on this site. Today, safety conscious companies are providing workers with competency-based fall protection training. That promotes a healthy and safe work environment. According to Alberta OHS statistics, one out of every six workplace injuries is due to a fall. The type of incident we most closely associate with the word fall is the lower level fall. The most general category is a fall from roof or a fall from a structural member. Falls that occur on site range from slips and trips to falls to a lower level. Workers who are involved in falls to a lower level are more likely to suffer serious injuries or worse. This program will focus on prevention of these types of falls. This is hell. Part of a crew that is consistently used for working at height and is exposed to the risk of falls on a daily basis. Hell as a wife and baby at home. Now well, that's a good reason for having a safe workplace, including a good fall protection program.